What up, YouTube? We got our pan turned onto a medium. We're gonna take some butter, some of that country crock original. We're gonna slap it in there, slap it in there. Yeah, we're gonna need a shit ton of butter for our little uh, deal here. Yes, give us a nice pan of that. Big old scoops of country crock original. Let's go. Now we got that in there. We're gonna let that do its thing. Mm hmm. We're gonna add some Bud Light. A little bit of that Bud Light. All right, all right. Now we're gonna take some leftover ponchos and we're gonna make a bomb ass burrito out of it. Now the burrito I have is a California burrito which consists of all the good stuff like steak, potatoes, and sour cream. But I do it up and I have them add beef, bacon, extra cheese, and guacamole for what I like to call a Viva La Mexico burrito and it is simply the fucking dankest burrito at ponchos. I don't care what anyone says. All right. But now we have it in our bag and we're gonna fry the burrito up in this uh, buttery goodness. Kind of chimichanga it a little bit. Yeah. Get that butter nice and melted. That, that's what's up. Shoot, YouTube. We definitely got enough butter for our pan. I'm gonna put the, uh, the good stuff right here away. Yes. Not a sponsor. YouTube. Watch out. It came with some sauces, but we're going to wait till the end to put those on there. You feel me, YouTube? All right. All right, we're going to need some napkins. Look at the size of this fucking burrito, YouTube. It's ridiculous. Okay, you see that, YouTube? Let me show you the goods. Let me show you the goods, damn it. Look at that. Look at that fucker, dude. Hold on, I'm getting a close up of this goodness, YouTube. That is a burrito, okay? You see this mo massive motherfucker? That's a burrito. And we're gonna drop it the seal side in first. See where the seal is at right there? We're going to stick it in there like that. And hold it down on the seal so it seals up. Now the goal for this is to make the burritos, or the burrito, you know, nice and golden brown. So we're going to try to chimichanga it and make it uh, look tasty for you. I mean, don't get me wrong, this is pretty good by itself, but when you... Uh, <laughs> You get leftover Mexican food, fry it up in a uh, pan with some butter and some beer, and, uh, you know. Chimichanga, that bitch. I'll hold it down flat on the seal so it doesn't fall apart. Mm. Hot burrito. It's gonna be hard to fucking rotate and flip in the pan here. Try not to break it open. on top of our burrito. Just a little sprinkle of that on top. Not a whole lot. A 
Okay, you might need to use a fork for this. Oh, shit. There we go, we flipped it. Oh. Alright. You got a method for flipping it, beautiful. Now we cook our burrito in this buttery goodness. We want the shell to have a nice crispy tan texture. That's enough beer for our burrito. Perfect amount. I'm gonna do a thing. I'm going to periodically flip it and rotate it just to make sure that we're not burning the fuck out of it. YouTube, and I said it was a burrito. We're deep frying her up. Ah. Shit. No, don't fall apart. Come on. Please. Okay. Not quite going according to plan. And I'm not liking this. It's starting to fall apart. Son of a bitch. Might have to pull it off a little bit earlier than I wanted to. The effect I was going for is going to fail fucking miserably. I can already fucking see it. Lovely. I might be able to save it. I might be able to not. We'll just see. If I don't fucking complete it like I wanted to, I'll just delete the fucking video and then I won't post it. It's all you can do, right? Ah. It's not uh, crisping up like I was hoping. Turn the heat up a little bit. I wish I didn't use that end for it. And I dropped the fork. Son of a bitch. Okay, we got a nice little crispiness on the one side. Maybe this won't be so bad after all, tubes. Oh, grease is popping. Yeah, that shimmy chong it up. I got the burrito grilled up, so we might be able to save this. It might turn out decent enough, YouTube. It's starting to shimmy chong it up, so maybe it's not the complete loss. I was... Yo, hold up. You looking sexy in there. Yeah, that's a nice crispy, crispy shell. That's what I was going for. 
Not all of it's going to be crispy because it's kind of starting to fall apart a little bit. That's kind of my bad, but whatever, dude. Go ahead chimichanga, chimichanga it up a bit. Hot, greasy. I'm gonna put it on the plate. Ooh, hot, 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 Jesus Christ, that is fucking hot. Okay. It did uh, get a little uh, chimichanga a little bit. Not quite all the way, but that's all right. It's enough to for what I want it to do. So I can't really complain right there, that doesn't look half bad. Turn the heat off. Chimichanga does. You can see we got a nice uh, little crispy on there, not too crispy. I don't want it to fall apart, so just enough to get it lightly crispy. Okay. Now we're going to add some stuff to it. I want to sprinkle on some of that cheese, some of that nice uh, sharp cheddar cheese. All right, on top of our chimichanga. Oh, look at that. Just throw it on there. Just throw it on there, man. Don't just, don't give any fucks. Just throw the cheese on there, man. Yeah. Put that cheese on there. You know what I'm saying? Just throw the goddamn cheese on there. Just show no mercy. Throw us some cheese on top of that bitch. Look at that. All that cheesy goodness. That'll melt to the burrito. Beautiful. And then last but not least, we're going to take some uh, Doritos, just a little tiny handful, and squeeze it on top of our uh, our cheese. Oh, chimichanga. Uh, excuse me. Nacho cheese. Doritos. Always a favorite. a little bit, crunch them up, put them on top, like a light sprinkle, just a light sprinkle, just a light sprinkle. Yeah, that's enough Doritos. Just enough to coat it. Now we're going to stick it in the microwave and we're going to melt the cheese all over the top of our uh, chimichanga here. Whatever you want to call it. Food hack. Get that cheese nice and gooey. Okay. Delicately lift it into the microwave. Oh. Want to watch it like a hawk so when the cheese gets nice, ooey, gooey, please me, tease me, squeeze me, yes, please. We're going to add 
some hot sauces. We got our green and our red sauce. not fully chimichanga like I said I tried to roll it in the pan but it was starting to fall apart so I did the best I could YouTube you want a cooking video that's basically what I do if I have like leftover tacos in the fridge from like the last Mexican restaurant I went to but Poncho's is more authentic than uh, Taco Bell no offense to anyone Whoa! Oh, it's gonna go a little bit longer. Yeah. All right, all right. Then we're gonna take a fork, and we're gonna another fork, and we're gonna put put the cheese that's melted on the side and put it on top. Yes, that's beautiful. Hold up, YouTube. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, that is fucking beautiful. Wow, look at that. Oh, that is gorgeous. Fucking gorgeous. I'm going to take all that melted cheese that's on the side. And we're just going to drizzle it on top. Get your sexy, cheesy ass on there. Don't play with me. Uh-uh. Get, get on there. Okay, there we go. Beautiful. Okay, now I got a clean fork, and look at that burrito so far, ladies and gentlemen. That's just, dude, that's ridiculous. Ridiculously good. Okay. Now we got two things are green, two things are red. Enough said. Put it on there. Drizzle it. Drizzle it. Drizzle it. Drizzle it. Good. Now for a little bit of heat, we're going to take our leftover poncho sauce, and we're going to just... Put up, put it all on top, man. Yeah. I'm gonna let it cool off too before I dig into it, to be honest, because it's gonna be a little hot. Fresh out of the microwave, fresh off the uh, the pan. In the presentation, really, I'll have to drink some of the sauce on the side here. Mm. Mm. That combination of the green and red sauce, they're spicy, flavorful. YouTube, does it really matter if there's a bunch of excess hot sauce on the um, plate? I kind of think it does. I mean, I don't, I don't mind hot sauce, but at the same time, you know, I don't need a shit ton of hot sauce. Just enough to, uh, you know, flavor it. Hold up. A little bit of hot sauce won't hurt. Just enough hot sauce to uh, soak the bottom of it a little bit too. Good enough. YouTube, look at this chimichanga. Look at it. Look at it. Part two, I'm going to be trying it after it cools off a bit.